Now, after hosting a successful Winter Olympics last month, Pyeongchang and the sub-host city of Kangneung are once again fired up to deliver another massive celebration of sport. The Pyeongchang Winter Paralympic Games will kick off its 10-day run tonight with a grand opening ceremony. Our Won jung Hwan is standing by for us at the Olympic Plaza in Pyeongchang. So, jung Hwan, what's the atmosphere there like? Hi, Mark. Yes, the Pyeongchang 2018 Winter Paralympic Games will be open today. And the atmosphere here is a bit quiet as the opening ceremony will, will be start, will not begin until 8 p.m. tonight. But when the sun goes down, the crowd will be packed with thousands of people from all over the world. And here are some of the highlights of the people who have already gathered around the stadium. Let's take a look. Uh, we're just very excited to be here. Um, the expectations, we just want to be a part of something that's so big, and especially here in Korea. We know that it's going to be something pretty incredible. At the Olympics opening ceremony, there were some spectacular drone performances. And as the opening ceremony is all about special performances, I am looking forward to it. Well, from what I saw of the Olympic opening ceremony, um, it was very spectacular. I mean, the theatrics were beautiful and um, there was so much representation of the Korean culture, which I think was really cool. And to tell you a little more about the Paralympics itself, just like in the Olympic Games last month, it will also be the largest Winter Paralympics ever in terms of participation, with nearly 600 athletes from 49 countries participating. Although 13 venues were used during the Pyeongchang Olympics, this time only four venues will stage events in six sports for a record 80 gold medals up for grabs. Well, we do look forward to watching as many of those events as we can. And it goes without saying that we'll be bringing you all the updates here on Adirang TV. Now, Zhang Huan, the Olympics last month were freezing cold. It's basically mid-March now. Uh, so how's the weather in Pyeongchang? I must say it doesn't look that much warmer than now, but can you tell us if it is a little bit milder at least? Yes, Mark, it's March, yeah, as you say, but we had some heavy snow since yesterday, and the snow is still keep falling even now, giving the organizers just a little bit of time to clear up the snow before the opening ceremony, which will be held at the at the Olympic Stadium in the evening. As you know, Mark, the o Olympic Stadium, the Pentagon-shaped arena, which can hold 35,000 spectators, doesn't have a roof. To clear snow from the stage and from the seats, organizers are using every resource available to accommodate visitors. Workers and a nearby military unit have been dispatched since this morning to clear any remaining snow. We're expecting a crowd of fully packed 35,000 people to watch the fun here tonight. That's all for me now, and I'll be back in the evening with more detail about the opening ceremony. Back to you, Mark.